Okay. End of the line. She came home. Carlisle's lost an empire. You fall hard enough, you tend to be reminded of what truly matters. He's so, sharp as hell. Y'all see that coat? Line. You ready for this? Are you? Who will you be without a score to settle? Ooh. I guess the world's most wanted fugitive will have to do. Alexa Carlisle is dead. According to the funeral invitation, that is. So naturally, it caused quite a stir when the late matriarch turned up at the breakfast table, alive and kicking. Carlisle, now she her dad. that her number is up, has emerged from exile to tie up loose ends and secure the Carlisle legacy. She may be a monster, but you have to admire her due diligence. Carlisle descends from an ancient line of warrior aristocrats. Her great-grandfather made a killing in the Second Opium War and established an empire in shipping, railroads, and newspaper publishing. While largely unknown to the public, the family still asserts its quiet dominance over global transport and logistics, media, and technology. Most senior of the partners, Alexa Carlisle, is cold as ice, tough as nails, and sharp as a razor. Incidentally, she is cold it was her late ice. father who first brought the three families together after the end of World War II at this very house. Meaning that this gentleman is the birthplace of Providence. Okay, so Began this here. is why this mansion and is important. Here. Yeah. Talk about poetic. One more thing. According to our intel, Carlisle keeps a case file on the constant. Information that may be helpful in his recapture. So don't leave the estate without it. Right. Happy hunting, 47. See you on the other side. Serious Lapidus. Imagine sending out invitations to your funeral for Hitman to come and kill you at your fake funeral. <laughs> the Carlisle family's home for countless generations. The revenant Alexa Carlisle and her three adult children, younger brother Zachary, grandson, and daughter in law, are all gathered to conduct Carlisle's sham funeral. Curiously, Carlisle summoned a famous London PI soon after arriving this morning, but his purpose at Thornbridge is yet unclear. Now, Does she think one of her children? Coming, and her guard detail is top-notch. So Mr. Gray will secure their nearby field HQ and intercept all calls going in and out of the estate. Any appeal for backup is going to fall on very deaf ears. Good luck to you. When do I ever get backup, though? I never get backup. So death in the family. So we have one target this time. The only thing is that we, um, oh shit, they see me already. I can't remember how to crouch, there we go. can't get in the water? Come on. That is Phineas Whitmer, the famous private investigator hired by Madame Carla this morning. I'm curious why he's here. Maybe you should do some detecting yourself, 47. Okay, so I did not realize there were going to be two gentlemen right there. So I thought that the easy thing to do here would be to...
I gotta watch out for the shrubs, man. Here. Okay, so the maid does not like all the guards, okay? Oh, by the way, now I told Kate about the test. What did she say? Well, I thought she'd be mad at me, but she just thanked me. Said she understood the position I was in. I, we had a really good talk about it. Oh, what did I tell you? She's a sensible woman. And that stuff from your ex was like manipulation 101. I know. I guess I thought she was going to be okay. okay. I wonder if one of the boys are like shooting. Um. Ducks or whatever. That's what it sounds like. Why is he coming this way? I was about to say. They better go head on. Okay. On top of everything, Rosie thinks she's in love with young Patrick. I mean, that's a breaking heart happening if I ever saw one. And that detective asked to come here. Madame Carlyle must believe Zachary was murdered. Why else ask him to snoop around? I feel weak in my knees from all the tension here. And we'll all need a vacation when this is over. Please don't come over here, Miss Man. Please. I low-key want to uh, climb through this window, but I feel like if I do, I'm going to get caught, you know? Like, is she just going to... I don't know. Like, is she just going to... Hmm. I don't even know which one of them saw me just now. That was kind of out of pocket. Maybe neither. Let's try it. I'm feeling a little risky tonight. How y'all feeling? Let's let's try to jump through this window. Hey, oh shit! That didn't work. That didn't work. That didn't work. You didn't see anything. I'm in the trash. They wouldn't check the trash, right? This is red one. Lost visual on target. Standing down. Out. Yo! <laughs> Yo, they didn't catch me. Okay, but if I can get one of them, like, alone, then I'll be able to, like, steal their outfit or whatever. But that's not a good way to enter. I see that now. Okay. Hmm. Should I, like, tackle a groundsman? I feel like that's my next safest bet. Cause this is bent here. So maybe I can, uh, no. Hmm. Hmm. Okay, I'm just thinking, I'm just thinking. It's just too many of them, like, for me to take out just one. <gasps> uh, 
No. Oh, that was close. Oh, crap. What's this? A safe in Madame Carla's office. I bet that's where she keeps the file on Arthur Edwards. Okay. So we gotta get to her office somehow. a beautiful garden like in maze I would love to uh you know okay oh who is this what a marriage splendid dynamics between the two loaded with conflict unsaid fears and desires I could just stay all day so he's having issues with his marriage Clearly, they want us to know that. <laughs> For what reason, I don't know. But I'm not supposed to kill none of the sons. I thought he wasn't going to be standing there, though. Like, go back inside, bro. Okay, so I don't think, I wish he could like climb this or whatever, but I don't think he can get in from that way without being detected. Oh, it is something over there that I need. Crap. See me. She expects the family photo to be done any moment now. I need this shoot to happen, okay? And I exactly need to see you in her way. A real one. Okay, so they were supposed to be having a family photo shoot. Um, that it doesn't look like. Like, is this man gonna? I don't know if I can get in from here. So it's like, should I risk it? I don't know. And it's a man right there. I'm going to try to risk it. I'm going to risk it. No, because he, he playing it. He playing it. Let's work our way around the garden. To see if it's something I can get like from the back end. Because I'm seeing like a whole bunch of entryways and exits on the back end it's gonna be rough i already know i'm not gonna walk out of here without killing somebody so if y'all came here for that you're not gonna get it If I can just get one of their outfits, but even if I got one of their outfits, I don't know that I could um, walk, just like walk inside. Like, I wish I can just throw my axe at him without that one noticing. Oh, shit. I don't think that's a good idea, you know? Mm. Oh, fuck. Thought I heard something. Checking it out. Over. They so pussy. Why would you radio over that you heard an axe fall in the garden? Not 
not in the mood for playing games here. Can I get a shout out for their channel? Oi, you need to discuss. <laughs> well, I give all these people these two piece combos. Uh, welcome everybody from Black Girl Gamers. My name is Al. I go by Al Rollo. I'm a variety streamer. I stream when I want. I play what I want. Right now, <laughs> we're playing Hitman 3. Rogue One, we have a breach. I'm looking into it. <gasps> Why did he kill him? Dude. You are gonna regret this. How do they know it's me? I don't understand. Twenty meters. No visual. Flush him out. Control from Mike One. I've now moved to grid figures eight. To oh. Telling my location and all of that. Okay, Time let's just. Oh my god. I'm clearly gonna die, you guys. <laughs> Trying to see what's in the area <laughs> while I still can. Taking a jog around the premises. If I can make it over on this side, like I'm wondering. You better shut your trap, lady! I'm not like them, alright? I'm just a journalist. Okay, then keep going. That was a shot. Keep going! Oh, yeah. Come on. Ah, shit, ladies! I know before we went this way, right? There is no way I could karate chop him and one of the maids not notice. Well, to be honest, it looks like the guardsmen are going to do that too. So, actually, let me just go ahead on and hop up here.
I wonder if I can get him. No. I just feel like they're going to make too much noise. There is an entrance right there, though. Oh, by the way, I told Kate about the test. What did she say? Well, I thought she'd be mad. But... Okay, I don't have a lockpick to open that. Oh no, I was got to break the glass. Let's get up in here for a minute. I don't know. It just feels comfortable. <laughs> oh, shit. Did he see me? I know that's not the butler. Go back downstairs, sir. No, Alfred, do not come up the steps. <gasps> there go my target, y'all. Is she coming down the that steps? That is Alexa Carla. <gasps> she is. Unofficial leader of the Providence Partners and last one to be alive. Hey, you. What are you doing? Around here. Well, you're not allowed. Hey, Yikes. You're standing here like some village idiot. What? Did you see something? We've got a trespasser. Thank you very much. You've been a great help. Did she come back downstairs? Friend leader to JHQ. No smoke, no fire. Standing down. Out. Okay, she came back downstairs. Mr. Whitman. A great tragedy has fallen upon us, and I need a quick resolution handled with absolute discretion. I have yet to see a mystery. I haven't stopped. And I don't give a toss about my fame, if that's what you're worried about. My little art. Very well. I suppose you will want to start at the crime scene. You assume too much, Mr. Carlyle. The crime scene, if such exists, is never where I live. Do as you wish. However, I expect a result in a timely fashion. Firstly, we'll take over the scene. Ha ha! They won't recognize me in here. You know what did it, you guys? It's the feather duster. I just thought of something. I think I lost a button from my cuff yesterday, probably at the graveyard. I wonder what disguise um that I could turn into that the guards wouldn't notice me either, you know? Cool, you can blend in like that. What's this? Verified his identity. I did Still trying to drag us. Maybe we should get back to it. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Okay. We have a bathroom here. A barber razor. I'm not interested in overflowing that, so to speak. Uh, I am curious to know what's in the room next to this one. So, Look at me getting all giddy. okay, so that's Emma and Gregory's room. I wonder if I could uh, climb through, like if they have a balcony. Move past the window.
this is some really thirsty stuff. Like, you gotta really want that person dead. Because it is no way I would be doing all of this. Okay, I think I see where I need to go. They have an opening on the far right side. So I'm just gonna walk up in a room, you know? Like, why not? <laughs> Okay, I wish you could low-key, like, rob them, because they look like... A letter from Emma's mother stating that Emma is the illegitimate child of Madame Carla's late older brother, Montgomery. And listen to this. She claims to have witnessed Alexa and Zachary murder him. There's no family without secrets, 47. But this family seemed to outdo most. So Emma is not... Their child. Yeah, well, she's still family, though. Hello, sir. Hello. Okay, so it seems like security is not like stunning me right now. I just want to check out the rest of the areas, to be honest, just to see what we're dealing with. Hmm. If I were to go out this window and traverse to the right, I feel like that would look a little suspicious. So before I go that way, period, I'm going up to upstairs to see if I can find anything up here. Still alive, huh? Good on ya. Yep. Alive and kicking. Oh, he's gonna notice me, huh? I wonder why. I don't know. Okay, we in another room, another bathroom. They got some really nice bathrooms. Look at this master closet. I thought it was an additional room and it wasn't. <clears throat> Just looking for that darn... What's this? It looked like an important letter. Nothing. I don't know. Madame Carlyle certainly doesn't think so. Why else would she have asked that detective to come here? Hello, this is Cassandra Cox, Edward's ex-wife. No, I don't know what's going on at your house, but Edward is losing it again. The swollen eyes. He seems to believe. Does the help normally just play answer machine services and nobody says anything? Curious. Okay, this looks like some sort of study. Um, we have a little hiding area here. I don't see anything in it of note. Oh, that got my target. Oh. There she go. Hmm. The thing about this is the target that they want me to investigate is directly below me.
Oh my god, he has a guard. He has a guard. Crap. Could I hit him in the head? Gotta dig this place. Ancestral graveyard, oh, here we go. trophy room, and the office safe is hidden behind the portrait with a secret mechanism for uncovering it. It's got real soul. The it's office safe is behind a portrait. A safe in Madame Carla's office. I bet that's where she keeps the file on Arthur Edwards. Okay, is this not her office? I see that portrait. Like, in a house like this, <laughs> isn't all these rooms your office? Probably not. Probably not, you know. I was here before the Turk was meeting with Patrick London back. Did I understand correctly that I should give it to Rebecca in case of your death? Exactly. She holds the other one. I want her to have the file on Arthur Edwards if I die. I'm not fearful she will be in trouble if she knows. She will start digging when she realizes things don't add up, inevitably getting her in trouble. I'd rather she knew who she's up against. She's clever and resourceful. Who knows, maybe she'll be able to hit him where it hurts. But I mm. don't want her to get involved prematurely. Hopefully she'll never have to get involved at all. You faced great like obstacles th too, I know. We will persevere. It is my duty to make that happen. Okay. Can I see a mat on here? Because this is a lot. Hey, Tori. Hey, Willius. Happy Friday, y'all. What's up, Nip? Or Mark, however, you, whichever you go by. Hey, DJ Mercy Merce. Hey, Jay. Hey, Ken. Yes, I'm doing stealth. I'm the stealthiest queen you know, okay? No, um, we trying to figure out where the office is for this lady. Um... And, yeah, <laughs> I'm just trying to blend in, you know, not cause a scene, but, you know. Uh. She low-key looked like a target, too. Maybe that's Emma. Should I kill him? I mean, is it going to be weird that one of the staff's men is hanging out by the window? Like, no? Okay. Just gonna stand by the window. Let's go. There we go. Okay. He was the first non target that we killed. But I mean, in the grand scheme of things, we don't have a problem. Oh, he dead, dead. Okay. 
Why would I sit down? That's strange. Okay. Let's get what we need to get. Oh, he committed suicide. Okay. He was online shopping for boots. Okay. I mean, what did they want me to discover here? That's what I don't know. Let me sit here just to see. This is really creepy. <laughs> okay. Um. Nothing in the walls or anything. They not talking about nothing that way either. They don't even know he dead. Oh, what's this? Kitchen knife. You know. How did that other guard know that man was dead? It's kind of strange. I don't know. All right, let's uh, leave this place how we got in. And next time I see that lady, well, I can't kill her yet because I still have to get that freaking case file. But when we get that case file, then I'm killing her, okay? She's gonna have to die. And let me not have let me take out my feather, feather duster. I wonder if... Come on, let's go. Okay, he's normal. I probably need to go today, down sir. a level. I guess they got used to seeing me in here now because I'm noticing like they're not um, trying to clock me at all. It's a bathroom. The game froze. Still alive, huh? This family Still alive. was messy. Hold up. This family was messy. Finding out that that girl's, um, that girl is Denise. <laughs> like, that's kind of messed up. And that shouldn't be something you find out at your aunt's funeral who faked her death. You know, that's not something that you want to find out that way. I don't think I would like to be, you know, finding out that way. A fuse sale. Oh, I could have listened all day. He poured emotion into that instrument. Quite the poet. But you're right. It's beautiful. Oh, what is this holes? I wish you could like Spray people with it or something. I think it's kind of weird that they don't suspect me. I'm going to pick up this brick. They don't suspect me, but I still want to do sneaky stuff, you know? Okay. Uh, 
I'm gonna pick up the fire poker just to be picking it up, but I'm not planning on using it. I wouldn't kill nobody that way. We. Sir, sir, you dropped something. Okay, the lady I'm looking for is right upstairs. Okay, that's the back door. What is it? She scolded Mary for not making the beds the way she preferred. It's so awesome. Just discovered Zachary's dead body and was all shook up. I tried to tell Emma, and do you know what she said? She said things will change. What'd you say, here. girl? I can promise you that. And her son Patrick is just Damn. as bad. Just look at Rosie. He has no respect. Preying on the girls like that. How are things coming along inside? Is everything ready? So the whole family messed up. They be killing, huh? Stuff just now. I know I have to, but Amy thinks she might be pregnant. I'm gonna be a dad. Be Amy lying. pregnant? Hit the grave. Okay, so we have some rat poison. And I'm gonna tell y'all, I've never used poison in Hitman, I don't think, which is kind of crazy because if you're Hitman, I feel like poison is almost second nature. But if I use poison on the glass that was in that room, I don't know if it's going to kill her son and not her. And I'm not really trying to kill a whole bunch of family members. We the bloody thing four days ago. Oh, dear God, not this again. So I got hold of the officer. He says it was finalized, but then how can it be withdrawn? Okay, so this the whole family, all right. You know, they all look alike. They family. <laughs> okay. So it seems like everybody in this family is just. I was just having a laugh, dear. Must admit, pretty good. Gossiping, you know, and talking shit about one another. I'm gonna try to head upstairs and uh, see if I can find that office. Okay, she's up one more floor. Where are the stairs this way? Looking good, man. Looking good. They're giving me something new. So many compliments. I have no idea why this guy wants to be so suspicious. Like, leave it, hang it up. I think I need to wait for the maid to come back. Then I can sneak around like I did before. Cause there's no way I can blend in over here. And I'm wondering if I kill They just paying too much attention to me. So, okay. Yes, talk to him, girl. Talk to him. Thank you. Talk to your man. Okay, is this not the office? Pick apple, pick up apple. 
Just a fire poker. I don't need that. It's not in any of these. Isn't that the ledger right there? Isn't that it? It's a black notebook, I thought. Oh, behind the portrait. That's right. How do I interact with it? Let me feather dust it. I wonder, do you have to access it from outside, maybe? Let's see. No, that doesn't make sense. It's right here! Why won't it let me? <laughs> Yeah, I think I need to find, like, some sort of, um, uh oh Oh, yeah, some sort of button. This is what I was looking for. Peculiar icons above the safe. I wonder if they might be some sort of a code. Maybe have a look around the office, 47. Okay, hold up. I can't see those. We have a grandfather's clock, a telescope, a fire, and a moose, okay? So, the clock, maybe I have to put in one of these numbers. So let's say, well, that doesn't really make sense to me. Okay, the fire is seven. The fire is seven. Hmm. I don't see anything on that clock. The fire is seven. Now, the moose, I have yet to find. Oh, here go the clock, here go the clock. One. Okay. Hello, sir. Okay. We need the telescope and the moose. Telescope and the moose. Oh, fuck! I'm not supposed to be in here. Okay, telescope is nine. Telescope is nine. You need to explain yourself. I demand that you return my call ASAP. Sending a junior attorney is gross negligence of your responsibilities and will have consequences for your company. I hope y'all been writing down these numbers. <laughs> I will make sure that you mark my words. Okay, we got nine for the telescope. Is she gonna leave this place? Okay, she leaving, she leaving. No, she not. I just need oh oh girl to, I, okay, I think she's gone. But her guard ain't. Nah, she ain't gone. Dang, I was on a roll. Do y'all see that moose? Which moose do I need to be looking for? Is it that one over there? They got like hella mooses up in here. What's the plural of moose, guys? Is it just moose? Is it one of those? <laughs> okay, I need to take notes. So the telescope, while we wait on her. The telescope is nine. Oh, somebody is taking notes. Thank you, Mercy. Something was seven and something was one. Okay. Okay. Thank you. Okay. We about to get this. As soon as she take her monkey ass up out of here. Do not come up these stairs, ma'am. Okay. 
Okay. Come on, your ass gone. Okay, now... Like, isn't this a moose? Oh, that's a deer, huh? These are deers. A peacock. Should I just put in the stuff that, like, I know? Maybe I'll just do that. Gosh, I forgot the... One, okay. The clock is one. The clock is one. Uh, E, one. The telescope is nine. The fireplace is seven one nine seven where is this damn moose it's an eagle Is that it? That's the only thing that looks like moose-like to me. Like, you know? But I don't see no numbers on this man. Maybe I should whip out my camera. <laughs> oh no, not the poison. The camera. Y'all see anything, any numbers? I don't see no numbers. Is it behind this man? Is that a five? Yes, it is. Let me see. So 1975. <laughs> work 47 that's the file on Arthur Edwards okay so we got the Short. file time to take care of madam Carlyle okay what her bitch ass said yeah, her bitch ass coming back no she not no she not Oh, yes, she is. Yes, she is. But if her bitch has come back and I shoot her, let's say, because I don't care nothing about making it messy or not, can I vault and then get out of here is the question. Now, that I do not know. I do not know. Maybe I shouldn't try to kill her in her office. Maybe that's a bad idea. He always be thirsty, like, bro. Nobody's studying you. She still one four down. Can I kill her with a feather duster? That is the question. There her bitch ass at. Okay. How about right. I kill Let's her with something started. else? I want to keep this short. I know you have a lot of questions. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Should we throw a cleaver at her head? Is that too brutal for her family? Or should we throw a letter opener at her skull? I don't know. Or a kitchen knife. I don't know. I don't know. They just used someone's birth year, they did. I think, okay, so if y'all didn't notice, like I skipped out on a lot of the intel because if I were a hitman, and I want to know from y'all too, if I were a hitman, 
I wouldn't want to know that much about my target because I feel like I would get too emotionally invested in my target. So I have a question for y'all. If you, you all were hitmen and like say this was your mission, would you take the time to get to know your prey, so to speak, and her family or would you just kill her and be done with it? Cause I feel like I'm just gonna kill her and be done with it. But I think I want to throw a knife at her head. You know? That's just been my life favorite way. First, Zachary's sudden death is a great tragedy, but also a great convenience, as it happened just now. I'm dealing with the situation in a discreet and efficient way, and I expect your cooperation in all related matters. Second. The arranged funeral event tomorrow will take place as planned. It sure will, no lady. No one can know that I am still alive. I expect you, you won't be. at your part. <laughs> as you all know, I have a lot on my plate and need to focus on sorting everything out. So please do not disturb me with your petty concerns. You are all adults and as part of the elite, I'm too far to throw this knife at her head. I have to shoot her. deal with difficult situations like this. It comes late for most of you, but this is a chance for you to show what you are made of. That will be all. Get him in your sight. Mission complete. Ha! Oh my god, indeed. Oh my god. Why can't he just drop, like, right here? I don't understand it. It never makes sense to me. I'm gonna be honest with y'all. That's the only thing I think I have to say about, um... Hitman that's, like, really mad confusing to me. Maybe I can shimmy down that little pipe. By the time her family discovers, she'll be long dead. Well, she is long dead. <laughs> oh, I forgot I threw him off the uh, off the roof. No, I forgot. Forgot. Everywhere, go get out. It's the Constantine. But it doesn't matter. My evil plans worked! <laughs> I didn't kill that many people this time, y'all. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Thank y'all, I'm proud too. We getting better at stealth, okay? Before you know it, we gonna be a stealthy, you know, don't call me stealthy streamer. <laughs> what kind of streamer are you, a stealthy one? Okay, so this time I got a nutcracker. It took me 37 minutes to clear this, but I have a ton of more locations to master here.